An old video of Jada Pinkett Smith degrading her husband Will Smith on Instagram has now resurfaced and many people believe that this explains not only the Oscars slap but also their toxic relationship. Back in 2020, without anyone's consent, we all learned about the word entanglement. And from there, we also learned way too much about Will and Jada's relationship. Jada Pinkett Smith confirmed that she was romantically involved with singer August Alsina during an episode of her Facebook watch show called Red Table Talk. She spoke openly about this while sitting across from her husband Will Smith. Would you say she has been instrumental in you and I redefining our relationship? I would say don't just start filming me without asking me. Oh my goodness. If you could film me. The thing that really baffled people was that she did this with her son's friend. Jaden is the one that introduced August to the house, and then he went and got himself entangled with his friend's mom. During the one-on-one -on -one interview with Will, Jada explained that she and August had become good friends, but I guess he missed the memo on keeping things hush-hush. August then came out and claimed that he and Jada had started a relationship while she was married and Will had given him permission, which is completely false and only blew this whole thing up in the press even more. The couple also revealed in their conversation that they had briefly separated when Jada began seeing August, but with that behind them, they were apparently now committed to one another. Fast forward to 2022 and the pair seemed to be doing much better. They even attended the Oscars together. But alas, it was perhaps far too early for them to be making public appearances together. We posted this video on our Instagram page and one person believes that Will was actually acting in that earlier clip, but it really does seem like he is annoyed by Jada pestering him to record this video. But I would be remiss if I didn't offer up that perspective, so you you at least can make up your own mind about this whole situation. In the comments section they said, Bro, he's being sarcastic. Since when he first started to get into social media and everyone was making a big deal about his tweets and videos, he's saying to not film him to playfully act like he's big time now or whatever. They're sarcastically playing with each other. Now the connection to the Oscar slap might be one of the biggest reaches out there, but let's break it down to see if we can link this video to that incident. If that video is genuine and not acting, then it shows that Jada has a lot of control over Will. But that's not enough to explain why Will would just get up to defend her so quickly. So let's dive in a little deeper. During an episode of Red Table Talk, first broadcasted on October 29, 2018, Will opened up to his family about what he deemed to be the lowest point of his life, which just so happened to coincide with Jada's 40th birthday. He had spent three years putting together a documentary for her to play at her birthday party. In the doc, he detailed her entire family history, it featured hidden tapes of her grandmother that had never been seen before, and he even tracked down a descendant of the White family who once owned Pickett Smith's ancestors. He even got Mary J. Blige to perform at her birthday party. He described himself looking at Jada like the little boy that wants mommy to say everything was wonderful, but he didn't realize she was having a really difficult emotional time. After they got back to their room with Willow there as well, Will recalled Jada telling him, that was the most disgusting display of ego I have ever seen in my life. They then began to fight so much that a 10-year-old Willow emerged crying with her hands over her ears begging them to stop. A letter that Willow supposedly wrote as a child then also re-emerged and it was addressed to Tupac Shakur. In the letter she writes, Dear Tupac, I know you are alive someplace. I think that my mommy really misses you. Can you please come back? Can you please come back so mommy and me can be happy? I wish you were here, I really do, love Willow. So now let's go to the Oscars where Chris Roth makes a joke targeted at the woman Will is so desperately trying to please. He truly looks at her like he's protecting his own mother, which makes it 10 times harder to leave that relationship when it's just not working. Remember, Will laughed at the G.I. Jane joke, then turned to see a displeased Jada and then acted immediately because he assumed that's what mommy wanted him to do. I'd love to hear your thoughts on all this though because that's all the time we have for today. So stay classy and I'll see you in the next one.